Hey, good morning. I'm horticulturist Gary Bachman. It's time for another daily dose of hort. Well, last time that we were out here doing a daily dose with our um, earth boxes with the trellises up, we had sugar peas here. And, you know, we did the last harvest of the sugar peas. I went ahead and I, and I cleaned the trellises all up. Oops, pardon me while I fix that. Clean the trellises all up. I've got the earth boxes all recharged and you know, ready to go. So it's, it's time to plant some of, you know, mine and Kate's favorite vegetables, pickles. You know, and, and of course we're talking about pickling cucumbers. You know, and last year we had these nine earth boxes in this, in this row here. And we had three different kinds of pickling cucumbers growing on here just to kind of try, you know, three different varieties out. You know, and I believe we canned 150 pints of, you know, Katie's shaking her head, <laughs> 150 pints, yeah, there, there you go, of, of dill pickles. You know, and we had, you know, spears and slices and, and things. So this year what I wanted to do is I wanted to kind of expand the, the types of pickles that we're going to be making. And so we have nine earth boxes here. I've got nine varieties of pickling cucumbers that we're going to do. And I'll just get a little closer here. The burpee pickler we did last year and garden bush. We did pickle bush. But here's, a, here's one, and I'm not quite sure how you pronounce that, gel tros, but it's, it's, an, it's an ancient variety of cucumber that's yellow. And so I'm thinking if we can grow some of this, wouldn't that really be attractive to have yellow dill pickles in the jars? And hopefully they'll taste good too. And then another one that we're going to grow, and there's, there's no picture here, it's just a generic a generic um, um, package, but we're going to grow the little Mexican gherkins. Those are the ones that look like little mini watermelons. I think those will be fun. But anyways, just to, just to remind everybody how we go ahead and plant in, in the earth boxes, I always, I always try and do four plants per earth box, and it, it's, re it's really pretty easy. We're just, we're just going to take the seeds, and th these are the Boston picklers, and, and these are one, are one of the, um, the so easies from, um, that, that are all treated for um, disease resistance, getting the, the seeds to germinate quickly. And what I always do, I always put a couple of seeds in, in, each, in each opening here. And it's, it's not to have, you know, two plants per, per opening, but it's going to be to try to maximize th the, uh, the chance that we're going to have for, um, for um, plants in here. And so it's just using the, this ancient planting device, my finger, just, put, just push them in and away you go so obviously i've got eight more to do here this morning and i'm going to get on that so thanks for joining us and we'll see you next time for another daily dose of hort